Hi, I'm a land surveyor and I surveyed this mark. That's all, thank you. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Pi. I hope you've had a bloody marvellous day. I've been noticing a particular meme or trend um, regarding, a, I'm a photographer and this is a photo has been coming up on my uh, For You page on TikTok. So I thought I'd reproduce uh, the tre trend or meme, um, but using I'm a surveyor. So it was an opportunity to get my T2 out and uh, yeah, set it up and have a look through it. Quite a nostalgic event. Bloody marvellous. I bought the T2 from an old uh, friend and colleague. Well, from his estate, actually. And uh, I've had it in my garage. I've always wanted one. There are real, um, really good uh, one-second reading theodolite. Pretty much a benchmark, I think, for one-second reading theodolites. Uh, a theodolite only measures angles. Um, doesn't measure distance. So now, uh, not many people use theodolites these days. They mostly use what we call a total station, which combines the measurement function as well. But that all that one, the T2 does, is measure um, angles, vertical and horizontal, uh, direct reading pretty much to, to the nearest second. So they're um, sort of second level um instrument uh, used mo main a lot for control and for accurate setting out and that sort of thing so yeah a bit of an old workhorse so i got that out now this morning a lovely lion again and not a bad day and yes then i had programmed to get uh, complete the cycle of lawn mowing with uh, mowing side to the front in the street and I uh, I got all that done with a little bit to spare and then I had a uh, test to write um, for my students this week it was the last week um, before we go to a, a two-week break so for engineering surveying so I got that done I've still got to do some model answers and uh, you know get it printed off and stuff like that but yep no that's all uh, looking good and I've got here a, a time lapse um, from the deck today. Um, I've tried time lapses before uh, through the window, and no, they're not very uh, successful um, because the battery heats up. So this one was outside, just on the railing on the deck, and it seems to have uh, gone all right. I see a guy just going past and bending down and looking to someone. I think that's my uh, broom that I took out to sweep off the survey mark and then uh, left it there. But I found it later on and uh, brought it in. It, it's a broom that someone actually left behind at our place as well. So, uh, yeah, that was uh, pretty much my day uh, all, all covered. Um, a lovely sleeping and, yeah, some uh, mowing. and Oh, and uh, had a uh, birthday conversation with our uh, son uh, turned 33 in the last week in America so we spent uh, an hour or so with a video chat there as well talking to the grandkids and son and daughter-in-law and what have you that was very nice as well bloody marvellous so there we have the mowing program recorded 5,000 steps which is really good uh, 3 hours of admin and 83.9 gigs. Kalamata is a variety of answers in the comments below the video, please. According to my sources, there are four types of teeth. The incisors, canines, premolars and the molars. And none of the commentators today were able to come up with the answer for it may well be debatable how he had a uh, shot in the dark and was a little wide of the mark. And Moz appeared to uh, show a considerable amount of knowledge about teeth 
and reckoned that there was five. So I'm stuck with what uh, my advisors say at four. And well, we'll just leave it there. And no one knows makes an appearance on the Hall of Fame. But I think we're all covered in glory in one way or another. So bloody marvellous, fuel legit. This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.